everybody, I'm back today with a comparing video, this time between a Nintendo DS Lite and a Nintendo 3DS Now. Um, this DS I have had for many years, this Nintendo DS Lite I've had for many years. I got it for my birthday when I was in like the third grade, I guess. Yeah, when I was in the third grade, I got this, and I also have a black DS. This is a blue and black DS. I also have black DS, but that's at home. And then I have a pink DS and another DS, which my brother and sister own. And then I also have a white DSi, which is at home. And then the black DSi is my brother's. Anyways, and then this 3DS, I got it right to the world. And it was a, it is a collector's edition. One of the, this is one of the rarest I got. It is all black and obviously the 3DS is bigger than the... Uh, DS Lite, and um, I'll do a little comparing these. This one is definitely old because the screen doesn't stand up properly, like like it's missing one of these parts, but it still works at least, but it's just old. And um, it's missing a DS pen, obviously, somewhere along the line I lost it. This, they both have, um, and um, this one can play DS games and Game Boy games. This one can only play 3DS games and Game Boy games. This one has two cameras on it. This one does not have any cameras on it. It just has these two on it. And I'll do a little comparing video on these. Um, wait, I'm doing a comparing video right now. Sorry, I'll just do a comparing on this. So I'm going to save my camera a little focus. There we go. Um, the detailing is a little different. This one has a control pad. And has A, B, X, O, and B, and the start and select button, which are just those little push buttons. These two both have um, dual screen, but this one's rectangle. This one's a little wider because the 3DS is a wider model. The mic is right here. The mic on this thing's right here. This one has an analog stick and the control pads down here. And um, this one, the power button's right here, to so it's actually a push button instead of a slide button, instead of a rocker switch. Um, and the headphone jack is on the this on the on the back of this front of this and then the headphone jack for this is um I don't think it has a headphone jack um it definitely has a two cameras it has a wireless thing in a 3D mode um this one has the pen in it, it and it's um What's good about it is it's actually telescoping. This pen is it's like telescoping. So it just pushes up like that. And I'm actually going to turn both of these on. This one has a rocker switch. This one has a... They both make different sounds. This one has a push button. Oops, sorry about that. I need to turn the volume up on this thing. The volume button's a little loose on this thing. Let me make sure the volume's up on this thing. There we go. Sorry, my camera's not focusing on these. It's a little blurry. So yeah, for the DS, you have to press the screen in order to operate it. And then, of course, it says Start Game Boy Game. It thinks there's no DS game in it, but I will get that working. You just have to, like, blow on this. And I'm putting Super Mario Bros. in it. And then the Game Boy game that's blank is Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. And then the original DS is a DS that uh, my brother had. I never had it. I just... Oops, this thing takes a few tries to get it open. Anyways, I'll talk about my 3D... I'll show my 3DS. I'll talk about my 3DS when I get this working. <laughs> Man, this thing takes a few tries to pull because it's old. I mean, this DS is old, and then the 3DS is brand new. Alright, there we go. Now, as you can see, it says Super Mario Bros. right there, it's showing it. And then this one has Pecto Chat, DS Download Play, Start Games, and Settings, and all that crap. Sorry if I didn't mean to say it. And then the, the 3DS screen's a little different. This one shows the calendar and the timer, and the battery. As you tell, we have a full percent battery, full battery. This one, it, we got half a battery. Um, this one has a screen which shows, and you can move it with either the analog stick or the, um, this. So, 
and plus it makes a sound whenever it scrolls on it. Let's help and save the information. Mario Luigi Paper Jam is currently in it. Camera. 3DS Sound. Me Maker. Which of course I made my me already. Street Pass Me Plaza. We have the Nintendo eShop. Games. Face Raiders. Or in or um my bad. Fish Raiders. Activity log. And then we have Nintendo Viewer Zone. You can use either one of these to move around the screen. Download play. And then system settings. And then of course this is not a Peco chat, the other one does. And then it makes a different sound when you put a DS game in it. Of course, there's no DS game showing, since it's blank. And then what happens if you... There's nothing in it, so I gotta take this one out. Um, so I'm gonna turn this one off right now. On the DS, one thing I forgot to point out is it still shows the game even though it's not in it, but when you press it, it says to insert the game. So this I gotta insert into it, so I'm gonna insert Mario Luigi Paper Jam in it. Plus this thing has the um, 3D mode, so it's got a nice 3D mode, so you put that right there. Very blurry, isn't it? And then you just turn it off. Sorry if my hand's in the way. There we go. Let's put the game, let's put Super Mario Bros. back in. I'm gonna, f I'm gonna flip this up, I'm gonna flip it over. And then when you put a DS game in it, it makes a different sound. I'm trying to get it out. Oops, my bad. <laughs> Sorry if my DS is flipped over. It says 3DS in the back. Hang on. Um... Unfortunately, I'm going to have to put my camera down just so I can get this game in here. I'll try to keep you guys occupied. <laughs> Sorry if I'm blown. I'm trying to get this DS game to work. This doesn't show because of how old it is. I'm actually gonna turn it off. And then, actually, while you press this button, it says you can put it in sleep mode. So I'm gonna press power off. The control pads are a little different though on this. This one's actually a push button instead of a that that clicky button. And of course, on this side, L and R, which is to shoot for the camera. This thing does have a camera on it. All right, overall, these two are very good. I'm satisfied with these things I have. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.